This River Boys PSA is about decompressing the spine and popping the vertebrae because you know when I when we heavy do heavy squats or anything that compresses the spine, then it builds a lot of tension in the back, which uh, you know only comes out by popping the back like this. But then of course you're only popping a couple of the vertebrae, and uh, or uh, going to a chiropractor obviously would be the best thing, but. We can't really go to a chiropractor every single day to decompress. So here's a couple tricks that I use, and mostly this is for my mom who um, goes to the chiropractor a lot, which is great, but in between the chiropractor builds up a lot of tension in her spine. So a uh, really cheap foam roller is what I use at home, and I roll it like this, and it hits, seems to hit about 70% of the vertebrae popping them. And especially if you lay back like this and let it sit, on the hips and relax and it pops the very lower part of the spine and it, the problem is it does I can't seem to get like that upper that upper part under the neck I can't seem to pop it with the foam roller only a chiropractor is uh, able to get that for me um, this next technique is from Kyle Libby this is how Kyle Libby decompresses his spine he puts his hands on his thighs right here and he pushes and he manually stretches his spine out to decompress. This, this inversion table, it's pretty good, decompresses the spine, still doesn't seem to get that upper part that I said a chiropractor seems to be able to get, but it gets, stretches out most of the spine. This is what mom's been using lately, but she hasn't been able to decompress the very lower part of the spine, which I haven't been able to either on this, just kind of the the mid part is what this seems to work on. This is the original way that I always decompressed my spine is I'd put my hands on the countertop, straighten my arms, and let my legs and my hips hang down and stretch out the spine. So my legs are kind of relaxed, my toes are just barely on the floor just for stability, but the weight of my legs is pulling on my back. And that seems to get uh, a good portion of my back. And the final method that I use for spinal decompression is I just hang from a pull-up bar and let my legs hang down and just the weight of my legs stretch out the spine. So, I hope this is helpful to mom since you've been asking uh, more techniques to decompress the spine and then everybody else, a lot of my guy friends that have asked me about that. Um, who weight lift it uh, and squat a lot of weight which compresses the spine a lot. A summary about uh, my techniques for decompressing the spine is that the chiropractor is the most effective but that's hard to do on a daily or, or regular basis and thus the foam roller is the most effective way that I have found to decompress my spine on a daily basis.